Today I want to show you a brief demonstration of the Sky Seismo. It's an amazingly sensitive vibration sensing device. Let's uh, take a little quick tour of the device itself. Let's start off the battery. It takes a 9 volt battery underneath, housed inside this compartment. Simple screw to, uh, to undo it. And on this side we have the power switch and a small vent to be able to, to hear the tone that comes from the device. And that is it. It's a very simple device to be able to just get out of your kit bag or out of your pocket when you're on investigation, switch it on, plonk it down, and it'll start doing its job. So let me show you how it works. I'll uh, turn down the lights a little bit. Right, so I'm going to switch it on. A little green light saying it's active. And now it will detect any small vibrations around the place with a nice purple light so I'm doing very light taps around here ain't crazy right enough of that so one aspect of a lot of vibration sensors is that they require a uh, sensor module which is outside the device where this one is completely inbuilt with a custom designed focusing chamber which puts all the different vibrations it's picking into one point and then measures that. That means the hard surfaces you tend to need with vibration sensors are not necessary uh, with this device and I'm going to prove that now. So here I have a massive big block of foam. It's quite, uh, quite thick. It's about the thickness of the device in fact. I put that block of foam there and put that device on top. Turn it on. Still can pick up the vibrations I'm doing through the block of foam. And that's not a thin block of foam either. I you notice from that as well, it's a very quick response. Because even when it's beeping and the, the light's on to telling you there's something going on, it's still sensing. So if it, there's another vibration, it will pick that up and it will continue the beep. But you can hear the individual ones. So it's very, very quick, very, very sensitive. So there you go, I'm just very finger tipping the table. So I advise this to be good for putting slightly outside where a person is going to be walking around because if you walk around the floor this is going to be going off constantly. So put it a little bit away from where you're investigating or if everyone's very very still then you can have it next to you I suppose. It would be a good way of locking off a room for anything that might be walking on the floor. Okay, it's a quick demo. Thanks very much for watching. Goodbye.